All right, guys, today I'm going to show you how to install that right there. A mag lock for this door being controlled by motion sensor. Press the exit button as well as a, a pin code switch on the outside. See my wiring here, not fully done yet, but there's our power supply. All right, and in this particular case, because um, we don't have any room above the door frame or below the door frame to run our wiring, we have to run it right inside of the door frame itself. So you start by drilling a small hole then you get your step down drill bit and drill out the hole big enough um, for you to fit your wires through and then you take a fish tape um, and and I did the same thing here I drilled a hole and made a bigger hole with a step down bit same thing here um, so once you do that you want to make sure you run all your wires that you're going to need for each component to, to the relative spot to the hole that you drilled out. So in this case, it's positive and negative, plus the common and normally closed. Um, here it's the positive and negative, plus the device wire, and positive and negative on the mag lock, and then everything runs down to the power supply. to make it as simple as possible um, and I'll just go through it with you real quick um, first thing you want to take your power supply and you want to take the positive and negative of each component and wire it up to the power supply should I mean all your red wires from every component to the red on the power supply all your black wires from the every component to the negative on the power supply and in this case we're using a adjustable uh, power supply that goes from 0 to 24 volts you want it to be close to the 24 volts because anything less than that won't power the on switch or the device out on the motion sensor which means you'll get no power at the mag lock all right so after you take the positive of each component and wire it to the positive of the power supply and the negative of each component and wire it to the negative side um, you have power at everything but now you're going to want to wire everything in series now um, in most cases series would be like positive to negative negative to positive positive to negative negative to positive but in this case we're going to use we're going to run a series circuit using the common terminal which is um, kind of like the positive and then the normally closed side which is kind of like the negative on each component um, or at least these two components the press the exit button and the card reader uh, and the card reader so after you um, power up your motion sensor and you're going to need to run a small jumper wire from the positive 
on the motion sensor to the inside inside the same motion sensor that that just jumps the power over to be able to power this device out based on what the eye is doing so anyways you want to take that jumper wire put it into the inside of the motion sensor then you want to run a wire from the device out to the common side on the press the exit button then you take your normally close on your press the exit button and run it to the common on your card reader then you take the normally closed on your card reader and run it to the positive side on your mag lock and then you run the negative wire of your mag lock back to the negative terminal of the positive or of the power supply that simple guys I mean don't make it hard the device out to the common on the press it press to exit normally close on the press to exit to the common on the card reader normally close on the um, card reader to the positive on the mag lock and the negative on the pack lock to back to the uh, negative on the power supply which gives you that series circuit and um, let's see what we got in the notes here oh yeah so we said all that all right, there it is, guys. Any questions, um, hit me up. All right, guys, I hope this helps you save a little time and a little money. I know it did with our association. Um, the door guy wanted to charge us about $3,600 to install this Maglock, so... This helps you guys.